Hey everybody, Claudina9 here, and today I am going to be using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette to do my eyeshadow. So that's literally what I'm going to skip in and do because we've all seen me do my makeup, my contour, and how long it takes me and how much of a mess it comes out anyway. So we're just going to go right into the Modern Renaissance Palette, which is my eyeshadow. Um, I'm still working on my eyeshadow, so if you guys want to comment any techniques or anything I should try, I would absolutely appreciate it. Um, I definitely want to try to branch out with my eyeshadow and um, get more cleaner, more like precise look. But anyways, so here I am doing my eyeshadow and I'm going to start off by highlighting right under my brow and in the corners of my eyes using the shade Vermeer, which is a matte, um, or no, what am I saying, Tempera, or is it Veneer or Tempera? I don't know which one it is, but I know that it's a matte shade, so it's whichever one is a matte shade and I'm really, really sorry that I messed that up. I really should be paying more attention, especially for you guys, but um, after I go in with Veneer or Tempera, whichever one that one may be, I go in with Raw Sienna and then I use that as my transition shade. Now, I really, really love this color. I feel like it just made everything blend together so well. I absolutely love, love, love this entire palette. I love the ultra matte shades. Um, I just, I love anything ultra matte. Like, anything that's a matte shade, I just, ugh, I love it. I love, love, love matte shades. Okay. So, after I go in with the Raw Sienna shade, I am going to go a shade darker. And that is going to be, give me a second, because I'm going as I watch this, kind of playing it by ear. I know, I, I don't want to script it, because that's lame. <laughs> but um, I'm going to use the Burnt Orange shade, and go in with that. Alright, alright, I'm going to blend it out, I'm going to blend that out. you got to blend it out. I feel like my eyeshadow comes out a lot better when you blend it out, you know what I mean? Like, when you blend your eyeshadow, it just looks so much better, okay? So, after that, I'm going to use Love Letter. So, Love Letter is so, so pretty. I absolutely love this shade. It's like this, um, it kind of has, like, some mauve undertones, but it's, it's also, like, magenta, and it's just, it's really, it's like a pretty burgundy, like, oh my god, I just love it. I just love it. I really love this eyeshadow color. So after I have used Love Letter, I'm going to uh, diffuse that using a blending brush. And then I'm going to go under my eyes and go in with um, Tempera or Veneer, or Vermeer, whichever one I used. I'm sorry if I pronounced these wrong, I'm really not that smart when it comes to a lot of things. And this is one of them, so I can't pronounce their names or the names of the colors, right, because I did not pay attention in art class. I just kind of did the art and not so much the class. So, um, I'm going to put that under my eye. Um, all the colors that I've used on the top of my eye so far, I put on the bottom of my eye, right below my lash line, and my lower lash line, that is, obviously. And then I blend that out with a pencil brush to diffuse that. Make sure we don't get any harsh lines. So blend, 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 blend. And then you have the completed look. Now I today am wearing the Lux Lashes by Eyelor. I believe they're by Eyelor and they are so pretty. They're mink lashes and they just feel so soft and so comfortable and I just feel like they look so, so pretty. Um, of course I did my eyebrows using the Cabral by Benefit, and then my lips are the Lip Kit by Kylie. You know, people were coming for my lips on Instagram. Whatever. Whatever. I think they look great. So, this is the look I did today, and I actually did a vlog. Comment down below if you guys want to see that vlog, because I did do a vlog for you guys in this look, going out in drag. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like it, comment down below, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. See ya!